When I was little, I stole something from my friend's house, and I don't remember what it was, maybe some toy, but my mom caught me playing with whatever it was later that night, and when she asked, where'd you get that, I eventually caved and told her the truth. She carted me back to my friend's house and not only made me hand it back, I had to apologize to Julia and her parents. When we got home, she sat down on our couch and started to cry. She was so worried that she'd raised a thief. I'd done so many things to piss my mom off to make her yell at me, but I'd never made her cry. And it scared me to see Amma in that intensely human moment. It scared me to see I could have that much power over her. Since then, I can't even walk out of a freaking library with a stubby old nub of a pencil I inadvertently pocketed without walking it back. And since then, I cannot look at my mother's face without being grateful for the soft lines of her uncertainty the tiny cracks in her confidence because in those small divots of Amma's humanity, I planted the seeds of the woman I am today.